Hello, we're here to review our Instant Pot pressure cooker that we got from Amazon. It's actually not a pressure cooker. It's a pressure cooker as well as a air fryer. It roasts, broils. It does a whole bunch of stuff. It's got 13 functions. 13 different functions. We really like it. We've used it to do a few things. Right, so um, for this pot, first of all, I love, 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 love this pot. So I've air fried in it. It air fries better than my air fryer. Um, halfway through the cooking process, it will tell you, it will beep and tell you to turn your food over because it doesn't have air circulation on the bottom. So you need to split, you need to flip whatever you're cooking, your air frying over so that it cooks, which makes sense. But it air fries really, really well and really fast. Um, I even baked a bread in here. Uh, you need to set your um, temperature lower than you normally would because. What I found was my top finished a lot faster than the bottom. Once again, I think it's circulation. So you need to just, you know, adjust it so that it bakes well and fries well. Um, and I've sauteed in here as well. And it does everything perfectly except for the main pressure thing. Pressure cooking. I, yeah, pressure cooking, which was the main thing I bought it for. Um, this pot... Uh, takes forever right now it's pressure cooking and I set it for 10 minutes as you can see it's counting down it's on two it has two minutes left however it took 50 minutes to preheat if you notice there are three bars for preheating it took 50 minutes for the preheating to finish if you notice there are two minutes left that's because there was a 10 minute countdown, which is what we set it for. So you see it's on the third um, dash for cooking. So three bars for preheating, three bars for cooking, and two bars for keeping warm if you decide to, to use that. So right now, we've been kept hostage because for over an hour, we have been unable to open this. Last time this happened, I thought there was something wrong with it. I was hitting cancel, all sorts of things. But this locks. Once you start to cook, you slide the lever from here to here to lock it. And until it's depressurized, this won't move over, which is actually a good thing. It's for um, safety. However, I wish there was a way for us to cancel it midway if you decide to abort. If you abort and cancel, for some reason, the electronics, it doesn't register. And it takes forever for the steam to you know to release if yeah. i wish there was a pressure like a release pressure thing that actually worked but that's the one huge gripe i have against this it does everything well except really, really well. pressure cook where actually it does pressure cook well it just takes forever and holds you hostage Aha. um okay now so it looks like... it's going to naturally release. You still can't open it because you have to wait, which is normal. It's a pressure cooker. If you open it, it will pretty much blow up in your, in your face. So one of the things I really like about this, on the inside, I can't show you inside right now, obviously, um, there's a pressure cooker lid on the inside of it. There's a red button. You just pop that red button. It pops right out when you're doing um, things other than uh, pressure cooking. So it's a really, really simple and easy to use unit it's that you really don't even need the manual for this it is great this is the fry basket that comes with it when you're doing your air frying um i love this pot absolutely love this pot the only thing i don't love is that the pressure cooking i don't know if it's this pot in particular or if it's all instapots but the whole wait time for preheating is ridiculous. Right. We set this for 10 minutes and we are one hour and about five minutes into the cooking process. So unable to open it or do anything. So if you decide to pressure cook, make sure you have a nice chunk of time because it will hold you hostage. Anyway, I think that's about it. I hope this review helps. Great pressure. Co I mean, great instant pot. There's a lot of things. Just... Make sure you have a lot of time reserved if you are going to use it for pressure cooking. Um, the stuff does come out super soft when you do pressure cook. I will give it that. 
just be prepared. Ooh, it looks it looks like we have about one minute left, I'm guessing, for from the natural release. So um anyway, hope this review helps you guys. Enjoy. Okay, we've been watching this for a while. It's been on Keep Warm, natural release, waiting for this thing to allow us to open it. Nothing's happening. This number has been going up. I thought it was going down. I'm going to hit Steam release, and I'm going to see if that lets it... Okay, it goes to two. Oh, there we go. I don't know if you caught that. I'm going to hit Steam release again. So it looks like if you hit Steam release, it looks like if you hit Steam release, it'll let some of the pressure off and you'll be able to open your lid quicker. So this part I like, at least it works. Last time it wasn't working for us, but then again, we never ended up getting to this point. Anyway, I hope this helps. Enjoy.